These Japanese taiko drums are not something you see very often in Myrtle Beach. But to Paul Gruber, they mean everything. Sometimes I'll think that I'm fitting in and really kids are kind of pointing out, oh, he's just that Chinese kid and I'm not Chinese. Paul is Japanese American. He's often felt singled out in the sixth grade as being different. It happens a lot, but it's usually with people when you just kind of walk by them in the hallway or something, people start going ching yang yang and just kind of Chinese stuff or whatever gibberish that really doesn't mean anything, but they just, they just don't care. But one place Paul says he feels proud to be Japanese is in Dr. Peterman's music class. He goes back to Forest Caroline Elementary every week to take lessons. Dr. Peterman teaches music from nearly 10 different countries, from Africa to Japan, and he exposes the students to a few of their cultural traditions. Most kids are born without prejudice. They learn that, and I'm trying to un or not let them learn that. Dr. Tim Peterman is from California. He's traveled the world learning to play cultural percussion instruments. He teaches his young students how to read music, keep a beat, and have a little cultural understanding. If I can teach them through music about these cultures, then maybe people will become more tolerant of other cultures. And enjoy learning at the same time. Africa and Japan are thousands of miles apart, but their music is bringing children together. It's like really, 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 really far away, and then you just, and then you hear the music and you're like, wow, that's not, that's really amazing. You get to play like different types of music and just, it's fun to play. And they start saying, hey, this is kind of cool. And they get more interested and they start caring more about it and it's, it's pretty nice. Nice, he says to feel like he belongs. Rachel Thomas, Annenberg TV News.